Good afternoon everyone and welcome to Pinox Smart Home Installation. If you are new to this channel, please to like and subscribe and to please to follow me on all my social media platform. Now today we're going to do something very interesting. We're going to use Google Chrome or any other web browser to have access to our security system and I'm dealing with the Anki brand. Now this applies to all Anki, DVR and NVR. So we're going to type in our admin and then our username is admin. So whatever DVR, NVR you're using, the username is admin. All right. However, the password is the same password that you use on your NVR or DVR to access your NVR. So any password that you use on your DVR, use it right here. So we're going to put in my password for my DVR system and then we're going to log in. Before that, you need to actually put in your dvr or nvr ip address this is mine up here so you can find your ip address right here all right so going back so this is live view playback picture and configuration um so we're in live view right now so to start the live view, we we'll select start all live view. And this is the live view of the living room right now. Alright. Sorry, the camera is showing in the ceiling just for um, security and personal business. Alright, so the camera, one, two three four so we have four cameras i can see one two three one two three four four three two one we are viewing all these four cameras right now if you want to view from five to eight we click this select this arrow that says next page you have to do it do it again and we can see from five to eight if we want to go view from one to four we go back however um i don't plug in any cameras in five to eight right now so those those channel don't have any camera right now so let's go back from one to four and this is one to four if we select zero channel I think we're going to see all the channel of the camera, all eight. Let me try. No. Yes. So we see all eight camera. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And we can actually maximize that to see all the channels all right so exit we're gonna select back one so that's all four cameras we're viewing live right now this is your ptz um camera control so pan tilt and zoom cameras that's the camera that can turn left and right up and down and zoom so this is the control for that type of camera all right so we're going in we're going into playback right now all right so playback as we can see right now we're in june 2021 and we're at the date um 29 which is a tuesday so we're gonna go back to may 2021 and we're gonna choose the first of may which is a saturday after we after selecting the first 
you're going to click search once the as you can see we select camera one and we're going to play that playback so we're going to choose camera two so we're going to choose camera two first and then we want camera two to play over here so make ensure that you select camera two and then we're going to play this is a five megapixel camera and this is a two megapixel camera and we can um full screen i will press escape on the keyboard to minimize it back good the good thing about this um software uh, we can actually play the cameras on different time during the day so as you can see this camera is in the morning and this camera is also in the morning however i'm going to fast forward this camera so we can watch the playback of each camera individually on different times so let us go so i'm going to drag this the time lapse and we're going to two o'clock just wait for it if it takes too long you can pause and play again let us try that again and release I'll try that again keep going back there all right there we go we finally get it it had some this app actually has a little hiccup but we can actually work with it so let us, let us try doing that again and release and it will just release it before it start to jump so you go here and release and it will start there release here and it will jump back there all right so we, we are playing two different um camera during the same day but different time of the day so this so as we can see this is about um there's a time one one twenty six this is i think this is pm and this one camera one is still in the morning in the morning why is this saying anyway so yeah so this doing the morning let's look at this carefully so this is Saturday and there's the date and the time let's see this one I think the time and the D envy I need to set Alright, so sorry for that. I think the time on the DVR I need to set. This is a new DVR and I didn't set the time. So sorry about that. So as you can see, we are actually watching different time of the day. Alright, let me try right here. It's going to jump back there. And if it takes too long, you can... Okay, it starts. As you can see, it's actually a different time of the day because just look at right here. Right here is actually shade. That means the sun is on this side. And this side is actually brighter. So the sun is on this side. Alright, let, let us have proof of that. Let us go back and see how that and see if it really changed.
Let me do that again. Yeah, it changed. See? There are little sunlight over here. So the sun is on this side. Alright, so with that said, we're going to see if we can do a playback on different days. Alright, so I'm going to choose this one. I'm going to let this one play and I'm, I'm going to choose this one. Alright, so let me... Let's see. Let us go to a different month. Let's go... 29 I want to click I think I have to stop this one stop it then click search and then I'm going to play let me just fast forward that you have to release it before it start to jump it's gonna go back there if it takes too long you can actually pause and play again yes and it will go back there so these are two different days so as you can see this one says the six and this one says the fifth see two different so that the beauty about this um software that anki have for the browser all right stop and we're gonna stop all right so we're on we're still on the 29th of june 2021 so we're going to select camera one and we're going to play we're gonna select over here channel 2 and then click play and then we're gonna select 3 then play and 4 4 and we're gonna click select play however these two these three are on the same time but this one is different so i'm gonna bring back that at the front and it will start right there so all of these camera are playing so let me go back here select this one bring it back there select this one bring it right there let's try that again and release i think this one has some bug in it Okay, so stop and start, pause and start, and it will go back there. Alright, so basically that's it. You can view each camera independently. And then you can actually play the sound to hear the sound. I don't have any microphone on this system. Um, here is another play. It's gonna jump back over there. Hmm. Okay, you stop and start pause and stop it and it go over and it will go over there. Alright, so guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Just think about it and this software actually works, but you have to give it some time. I hope um, Anki will actually um, send an update, uh, update and fix the problem on this one. But for this type of interface, you would use this if you put your DVR in a hidden place or in a vault. Where nobody can access this and you want to access the 
the camera system locally on your local area network and you want to just access it but you don't want anybody to know where the DVR is because person can actually track the cable of the system and then find out where you hide the DVR so this is a good idea to access your um, DVR or NVR again guys thanks for watching please do like and subscribe and have a good afternoon